and arrested for illegal butt injections. How could I not watch this without you guys? How could I resist to watch this? Oh shit, ad starting. <laughs> How could I have resisted? Like, come on. Are you guys ready to watch Arrested? Well, you put some. There's a song and this German, Russian, American, British, Italian, and Japanese version of the song. Oh. Ow. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 bam. Underground butt market where you can go to buy injections for your keister. And keister? They're. Administered by what people the fuck that is a aren't keister? actually qualified to be giving them. They're not medical professionals. And yesterday, oh. a mother and daughter do oh, got no. arrested for this. They travel around and oh, give no. people some injections into their tuchus to try and elevate their ass game to the next level. Like, like what? They travel around in like a fucking van with botox injections to make your butt bigger? Video's a bit quiet. I will make it louder. I will make it louder. Well. And they would have got away better? with it too if it wasn't is for those better? meddling medical license <laughs> requirements. You can't really just go around giving people medical procedures unless you're qualified to do so. For the obvious reason of it's dangerous, people die from it all the time. From botched procedures. Nice. Even something nice, as nice, simple nice. as getting your fucking butt cheeks blasted here with whatever substance they were administering, which they're still investigating what they're even giving them. Oh wait, they, they don't even been know? They out BBLs using fucking Play-Doh in a syringe. It's, it's not even Bodox? Like hamburger oh my god. Their butt. Like, there's no. no telling. It could have been anything. But anyway. Can you imagine it actually being a hamburger meat? I don't want to see that fucking infection. Even because the same as funny small sketch. Hmm, decisions, decisions. Oh no. Don't swap me into an Eevee while we're doing react things. <laughs> what you yapping about? We're yapping about videos. And about arrested for illegal butt injections, apparently. They made a public appearance yesterday. Uh, right now, they're out on bail. But I'll, I'll introduce you to Goof and Goober here Goof real quick. Goober. Consuelo Maria Dalbo made her first appearance in a Harris County court yesterday. She faces a felony drug charge and a misdemeanor of practicing medicine without a license. Dalbo spoke with our news partners in Houston while out on bond. She says her passion is helping people and boosting their confidence. <gasps> her face. She injected her stuff into her own face. But at least she's not only doing it to other people. There was that one doctor who was giving cement injections to her patients wanting both- I heard about that one actually! Holy shit! And that's the glue and random shit she could find. Jesus shit is wild. It took multiple patients for her to be found out as I'm not a real doctor. You got a license for that? <laughs> Believe me, everything I do, I do it with my heart. And everybody who knows me, they know me sometimes I do it because they really need it. What a bunch of fish paste. What, what do you the mean? Fuck she's making it sound like it. she's come, some kind of saint for doing this. Yeah, legit. Like what, what do you mean they need it? Need but just can't afford. You and your daughter were no just one preying needs on people's insecurities to make a fat payday. You were charging thousands of dollars to show up to their residence with a mystery liquid in a syringe. That could have just been turkey gravy for all Ugh. we know. No one needs an ass booster. She's trying to frame this like she was doing a good deed or a valuable yeah, service. Yeah, for her you weren't. out Unless of the kindness of her heart. butt cheeks and they can't sit down because they just slide off then the chairs she wouldn't or if they lay down in bed, want they money just for it. squeak off the side or something. There's nobody <laughs> in the world that needs this done. What do you mean? We uh, need it? Daughter in Texas who got we fucking for need it! Butt injections. Bootleg beef. Oh, I got so confused why there was a, ta a task oh, bar down there. Ago. Mother and daughter accused of performing illegal butt injections arrested in sting operation in Texas. Yay! Mm -mm -mm. That'll get you every time. Getting your you BBL from effect. Wish. <laughs> Mother and daughter accused of performing illegal butt injections without any medical expertise were arrested in Texas. Consuelo Dalbo, 56, and her daughter Isabella Dalbo, 18, have been charged with practicing uh, medicine without she, a license. A misdemeanor. She's How's that only name a misdemeanor? Double. No. Like that, is, that should be so much more severe. This well, I know a misdemeanor can be pretty severe, though. A misdemeanor? Only a fucking misdemeanor? What the fuck? 
I mean, that's that's big stuff. Practicing medicine without a license. Like, come on. Come on. People die from this shit. Legit? Four documents reveal the women went to a home to perform the butt injections on a customer who was actually an undercover peace officer. What? Oh. <laughs> they plan to charge 6000 for the service. Are they calling 6, them peace 000? officers now? Instead of police? Peace officer. Is this like some kind of rebrand or something? Why are they calling him a peace officer? That's some Hunger Games shit. Guys, police update Justin. Renamed to peace officers. <laughs> yes, peace officer, sorry. The woman... The women apparently were not crazy. even sure what was in the injectables, described as an unlabeled brown liquid. Emotion. They weren't even sure themselves? Where have they gotten it from? Where the fuck have they gotten it from? <laughs> Her bail written by Harris County District's Attorney Office said, This fundamentally demonstrates how remarkably dangerous these acts were. Consuelo Dalbo allegedly provided a Xanthax, geez, Xanthax, Jesus Christ, provided a Xanax to the prospective customer for the purpose of relaxing her before the injections began. The women were ultimately arrested Fuck. separately in the sting. Authorities also confiscated bags containing the illegal injectables and medical equipment. They don't they even know what it is. They were traveling across the country to give clients these illegal injections. The, the investigation into the pair was conducted by Houston Police Department's Major Offenders Division <laughs> Food Drug Administration <laughs> agents. What a long title. And Homeland Security. They're prohibited from practicing medicine without a license, as I think well, anyone duh. in the world would be. In 2021, police said a mother and daughter duo were charged with a murder in California after they performed a botched butt injection that resulted in the October 2019 oh my death God. of 26-year-old Carissa Rajpal. Oh my god! Police said that the mother and daughter had no medical certification. It was believed neither had any type of training. The jury found them guilty of involuntary ma manslaughter last month. Also in 2021, a Dallas woman was sentenced to five years in prison for causing a nightclub dancer's death by performing an illegal butt injection on her in Missouri in 2015. Bro, these butt injections get you every time. That's like a speed run to meet your maker. Dude! The butt has a lot of nerves and some important veins, if I remember correctly, so if it's performed badly, shit like this can happen. This can ha this can happen with any kind of procedure, though, from someone that's not actually licensed. Yeah! There was a Instagram model, actually, she might have just been like a full-blown big model, I can't remember, who died after a botched knee surgery that was supposed to, like, remove a little, like, what was it, a little cartilage around her knee? Because she didn't like the way her knees looked? Oh my god! So this can just happen anywhere. If you're being tended to by a less than qualified professional. Yeah, the butt's not the issue here. The issue is that people feel the need to That's what it was, removing fat make themselves from her knee. look better by inflating their butt. Influencer who suffered cardi the problem the problem is the Kim Kardashians and shit. That that's the fucking issue. Them like showing off the fucking fake bodies and Photoshop bodies on pictures, making teenage girls feel fucking insecure about their own bodies because they don't have that fat ass that they think is a beauty standard to live to, to live up to. Fuck off. Fuck off. Cardiac arrest after liposuction on her knee <laughs> went wrong. Which is a crazy procedure to get in the first place. Removing some fat from your knee? Yeah, like, what? Are you fucking kidding me? Yo, good evening, water element, the second. Injection to make his dick <laughs> or two, rather. <laughs> yeah, what up? billionaire died during penis enlargement. Oh my god. Yeah. This was in 2019. The billionaire a died from a fucking penis His enlargement. was Ehud R. L Lenido. Are you fucking kidding me? I already turned my ad block off for you. Now you're not going to let me read the article unless I sign up oh, for this? Oh, I hate that. You've got some nerve, man. Legit, whenever, like, I'm researching anything online and the website that I click on is like, disable the ad block to continue reading. I'm, I'm gone. I'm not, I'm not, I'm gone from that website. I'm not using you. Fuck off. Fuck right off. I get that you need to make your own ad money, but don't shove it up that way. Do not deny me access because I have an ad block. And bleh! anger. <laughs> it's incredible. It, the gall, the app, the state of the goddamn internet. And you're gonna autoplay an ad oh for me? Oh my god! Jesus.
What a joke. A wealthy Belgian diamond dealer has died of cardiac arrest following a cosmetic surgery in a Parisian clinic to enlarge his sex. Penoplasty is a surgical technique that dates back to 1990. Increasingly more popular, it has become a $5 billion market. What, what? the fuck? The go-go gadget extendo dick? I just didn't think these would be popular. I actually didn't even know these existed until Same. pretty recently. I thought that was one of those things that know. you just had to fucking suck up. I, I didn't even know it existed up until this very moment. I thought those were always like fake news kind of things, you know, like fictional stuff. There actually is a penis enlargement surgery? But hey, the guy died from, so is it really that worth it? I've kind of expected the risk. Yeah, like, motherfucker legit died from it. And he was a millionaire. He definitely afforded the best doctors to do it. And he still died. I knew they had some procedures for micro penises, but I didn't think you could really do one on, like, a normal, just small Belgian one. Belgian Israeli Belgian diamond, Israeli dealer. diamond dealer. living in the U.S., traveled to Paris to have the operation and succumbed to it. He checked into the clinic on the 2nd of March to enlarge his sex, said one of the medical personnel. The operation turned bad, and the client had a cardiac arrest. The doctors could not save his life. Wow. Yeah, I mean, they're fucking, they're, they're dick doctors. You have the <laughs> yeah. fucking penis patrol in there. What are they going to do to try and bring him back from cardiac arrest? <laughs> Shit, his heart is stopping. Jerk him off. God, uh, five cc's of epinephrine right into the nutsack. Quick. That's just all the information they have about it. <laughs> this is not a good, I wanted a little more info. On I don't know. It. This site just has like two paragraphs Welcome dedicated to it and nothing but ads. Up. It's like, yeah, this billionaire died from cock improvement procedure. But Bro. anyway, have you checked out these bikes? <laughs> Did they finish the enlargement? <laughs> Did they finish the enlargement? Imagine having millions to your name, but still needing a bigger dick. Imagine. Imagine he 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 couldn't kept this those women pleased with his money alone. The money wasn't enough. Feels bad. Feels bad. <laughs> yeah, imagine he can feel himself fading away. He sees the light at the end of the tunnel, but he's like, no, please. <laughs> Not with this sad, tiny micro. Just don't save me. Save it. Quick. God, please. <laughs> yeah, there's really just not a whole lot of info about it. This guy just died and they forgot about him. <laughs> open casket and open trousers. Oh, no. Yeah, imagine it's just like an open casket, but not like the actual head part. It's just like his lower body and he's nude. Oh. They all just point and laugh at him at the funeral service. The levels of compensation well, legit. To talk about him. He said the dude was apparently really insecure about himself, including his actual height. No way. He was so insecure that he would have his Didn't secretary read his bank statements to make him feel better. That, that can't be real. That's gotta be, <laughs> that's gotta be fake. I'm feeling bad about being five foot six. Can you please pull up the bank statements, Miss Secretary? I, I need something to smile about. Uh, Laser eye like, surgery I'm too afraid to get for table. like it was an issue with the anesthesia and a spark. Like, no way. It's probably been more than twelve years now. Holy fuck, that sounds terrifying. What? <laughs> Imagine you're just going in for like a routine procedure and all of a sudden you fucking combust. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Horrifying. Jackson just messaged me today about general anesthesia because he has to also get to change eye colors. So bad that they're actually the going to put him under for it. Just wait, lens, contact lenses. Turn him into a goddamn bomb. Just wear fucking contact lenses. Why the fuck get a surgery for that? What the heck? Uh, I I need to do the decent thing of being a human being and link the video. Here you guys go. I'm a decent human being. Yay! Think this always. <laughs> Fucking butt injections. Fucking dying from penis enlargement. A surgery. What the hell? You can laser pigments in the eye to get blue eyes. Easiest color change. I mean, I guess it would make sense, like, theoretically right now. I don't know about the practicality about that. But like removing pigment, removing pigments would I guess be way easier than adding pigments. Yeah, but that's insane. The power of art will do that for you. But honestly, just wear contact lenses. What the fuck? <laughs>